in continuation with the quantum theory and electronic structure of atom in this you are going to learn about hydrogen atom so let's go further and see what we are going to learn about we'll be doing some question based on the formula given over there this is basically we have hydrogen atoms has different levels in which the electrons can be present like basically it's always present in the ground state that is n is equal to 1 by giving energy we can push it to a higher level so therefore uh, the, if the initial level we call it as ni the final level we can call it as nf and uh, the equation for it is given over there and we will be doing some question based on uh, pushing of an electron from a lower level to a higher level or uh, bringing it back from a higher level to a lower level calculate the energy required to transfer an electron of uh, hydrogen from n equals 2 to n equals 6 principal energy level for we will use the formula delta E equals uh, minus 2.18 into the power of negative 18 and here the final level is 6 initial level is 2 so substitute the values appropriately and you get the value of energy and the energy comes out as positive therefore energy is absorbed so this is what happens whenever an uh, electron is shifted from a lower level to a higher level Calculate the energy emitted when an electron of a hydrogen atom drops from level 7 to 4 and also calculate the wavelength of the emitted light. So as usual use the delta E the hydrogen uh, equation, delta E equation and here the final level is 4 and the initial level is 7. Substitute the values and get the value of delta E. The value of delta E is negative therefore energy is released. So, in this case, they have asked you the wavelength of the light also. So, in order to calculate, use the formula delta E equals hc over lambda. So, uh, lambda can, it can be rearranged for lambda. We have the value of delta E, h and c. Substitute all the values into it and get the value of lambda after converting it into nanometers. Calculate the frequency of the light emitted when an electron of a hydrogen drops from level 5 to 2. So use the same equations and uh, final level is 2, initial is 5 and uh, can put substitute all the values and they get the value of delta E and delta E is negative and therefore energy is emitted. Here they have asked you to calculate the frequency and we know how delta E and frequency are related. Substitute the values of uh, H and the delta E and get the value of delta uh, of frequency. 5.31 to the power of negative 20 joules of energy is emitted when an electron jumps from level 5 to a higher level. Calculate the value of the higher level. So use the same formula and here they have asked you to calculate the value of Nf. Ni is given and everything else is given. So substitute the values the reason this is given to you is it will walk you through the steps on how to calculate if such a question is asked. So in order to calculate NF, uh, follow the steps which I have shown and remember that it is uh, the value you get as NF square and remember to take the square root of the final answer. At the value of NF I get equal to 8. Just to check on the answer you get is right or not, since it is going from a uh, lower level to a higher level and uh, the value has to be larger than 5 and it will definitely be a whole number. You don't get uh, decimals in the answer. The wavelength of the emitted light is uh, given when it jumps from level n to level 7 calculate the value of n. So in this case it's similar to the previous question only difference is in this case they are asking you for the lower level and again substitute all the values the delta E is not given so we have to calculate delta E first from the wavelength and then once you calculate the delta E use the hydrogen uh, atom equation and they have asked you the value of Ni uh, so what you get will be Ni square and then uh, get the value of Ni and again uh, here also uh, case should be taken while you are calculated the number will be a whole number there won't be any decimal and uh, since it is going from uh, a lower level to a higher level, the energy you get will be positive. 